Big man, you can't kill me. Yo, what you go do? You want to kill me? Sad times. Decomposing body phone in Lionel Town, Clarendon. Full attention right now. Some serious things are going on. Big up to all of my supporters. Beautiful Monday evening, all of you. Coming home from work, who going to work. Big up on yourself. All of you reach home already. Big up. You are going now. Clarendon with you. Lamin assigned to the Lionel Town police station are seeking the public's assistance in identifying a man whose decomposing body was discovered in Ali Downer, District Lionel Town, Clarendon, on Sunday, October 1st. So, right, you know, Downer District hot. Reports of Lamin are that about 6 o'clock pm, residents were alerted by a fall order and went to make checks in bushes nearby. They discovered the decomposing body. And summoned the cops. The scene was processed and the body removed to the morgue. The body is of dark complexion, medium built and about 5 feet 9 inches tall. And sports a dreadlock ear style. The body was clad in a black merino, blue pants and pink shoes. The Lionel Town police are appealing to citizens or family members who may know or have information on the identity of this man to contact the Lionel Town police at 876-986-3233. Visit the nearest police station. So that's the latest right now. Decomposing body. But I may tell you, people just a drop out left, right, and center. People look out the Monday. Gruesome. From Sunday night to Monday. Early Monday. People getting gunshots. You understand them killer uh PNP councillor daughter. Downtown Kingston, 31 year old. You understand? Them shot are drastic. 31 year old Walters. And then we all know about the killing them. Spanish Town Road. Mother and daughter. Wipe out. You know we have a few shout thoughts. Early squad. Big up to Beth and Smith. She commented first. Lisa Clark. Mitchell. Trust God. Big up yourself. Alicia. Ivan. Eustace. Jamaica Viral TV. Paula, big up yourself. Ellis, big up yourself. Winsome Foster, one Asian. And last but not least, we have Sylvester Allen. People all know how to get a shout out already, so just do the right thing. Try to reach early. Yeah, man. On behalf of the young man, and that bail application was successful. And, um, at the moment, we are expecting his parent to take up the, 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 the bail that was granted to him. Mm -hmm. So, what was the offer? Is it the sum? $300,000. Mm. And what are the, the terms of, of the bill? Well, uh, he will have to do some reporting, which we do not we will adhere to right so there are of course there are reporting conditions and we will adhere to those what is it to return to court uh he returns to court on wednesday of this week mm -hmm. what is expected to happen at that time uh, what what other documents if you were asked to bring back are right um and and, and hopefully by then all documents that are required to be brought in will be brought in and he will he will be on bail um, admitted well he's been admitted to bail he'll be on bail mm -hmm. oh, so they're saying that he has been offered bail mm -hmm. but there are certain um uh conditions that have to be met in order to to to, to satisfy what has been asked of the court that he has to do in order to take up the bail so what are those conditions or documents? There's a stop order which requires certain liaison with Pika. So that for now is um, the greatest consideration. Right? Um, can you say, since you're representing the family, can you say how the family members feel as it relates to the fact? As was expressed in court, especially his mother, they are so empathetic. And I expressed that to the court.